Hello and welcome, it's time to fill your boots. We're going to do a series of uh, videos every week and we're going to get organised to build you a portfolio of CCB services. We're going to throw money into the Betfair account and we're going to let you copy us so that you can use a service and just keep growing your account and make it like an investment account, like your Bitcoin, whatever you're doing. And this turns your betting into a solid strategy and we're going to be methodical and we're going to keep adding as we go. Now make sure you like the video and subscribe to the channel because if you do that, you'll get notified every time we do a change or we add something because that's going to be the important part. We're going to put the money into Betfair, we're going to set up a staking plan and we're going to do that method and the following week, we're going to add something else. So by the end of the whole process, you'll have a strong portfolio that you can keep building, you can keep working on and you'll be the boss. And it makes everything simple in your gambling and it just makes you strong mindset with your discipline and your patience and you know what you're going to make and how you're going to make your money. So the first thing we're going to do is we're going to go into the Ripple UK and that's a lay betting method that's absolutely solid. It stood the test of time and anything that can keep making money and keep hitting a new peak every month or every second month, that's something that you've got to be interested in. Because when you do that, that you understand that you're making money and you're constantly growing your account and you're not just doing a probability bet where you're taking 50 out of your pocket and having a bet there at the weekend you're going to have a go with 200. You're becoming an organised, disciplined better. And Betfair is the best place to do that because you've got a great platform to work from. So what we'll do is, this week, a thousand's going into the account, we're going to start doing the Ripple UK and we're going to do it with a 20 point bank. So let's go, let's get the portfolio on the road. We've got a thousand in Betfair, there we go, up here, thousand in. And what we're gonna do, we'll add next week, we're just gonna keep adding, we're gonna keep you growing, we're gonna get you an organized better. And it's just like watching your investments. If you've got Bitcoin, you've got Solano, you've got Cardano, you've got Ethereum, it's just a case of like watching that and watching it progress and it'll have our ups and downs, but hopefully we can maintain a steady pattern and just keep winning and winning and winning. And here we go, this is what we're going to add. This is just a this is just a snippet to be honest with you. There's five simple methods that we're going to play with. You've got your Ripple UK. This is going to be the first one we put in because it's a laying method and you can see it keeps growing and growing and growing. It's just about to go through another peak here. I'll go and I'll run here probably in September and end up in profit uh, above where it's hit before. We can look at the personal updates that's on the site. You can see that's as steady as a rock and that just keeps going uh, for the whole season and just keeps growing and growing. The football match odds and the VIP, very similar to the personal updates. You can just keep printing money and it just keeps growing and growing. The Ripple Edit Place, another one that's just, it plays at the sharp end of the market. You're gonna be betting some things that you're gonna say, oh, that's very short to bet. But you can see how that all mounts up. Now this has gone 13 bets, 15 bets in a row. Uh, uh, and it's just on, I think it's on a run of 13 just now. So it just shows you how strong and how powerful it is. It does have times where it'll just stay flat. But that's the whole idea of having a portfolio. Bitcoin doesn't keep growing every single month. It'll have flat periods. It'll go six months where it'll stand still or go up and down. And you can see when you start to add all these together, when one's not performing, the other one may well be. The Ripple Laws, we've got a wee uh, the race day worksheet. We'll throw in that eventually. We'll put in the Wednesdays and the Saturdays for Australia. So you can see straight away, we've got five things ready to go. We're going to start the first week with the Ripple UK. But as you can see, there's five ready to go and there's spin-offs and everything. There's spin-offs in the uh, personal updates. There's spin -off, There's another two match betting uh, methods to come out of the VIP and there's another two to come out of the Ripple Laws. So by the end of it, you're going to end up with about seven to nine different things in the portfolio that's just going to keep making money and printing and printing and printing. So it's a case of you getting organised and being ready to go. So we're going to add every week another method and we're going to add from the personal updates. We're going to add for the VIP. We're going to add the Ripple Edit. We're going to do the Ripple Laws and we're going to grow steadily and we're just going to keep growing and growing and growing. We don't want to be a probability punter, we want to be a winning punter. We know we've got an edge on our stuff and our information and our data and we know that you get a Twitter punter out there and you'll see them. If you just watch, you'll see them coming in, giving you a lay, giving you a back bet and all of a sudden they say I've had five winners in the trot, six out of ten, nine out of twenty, whatever it may be. But it's over three months, they'll probably have disappeared because they'll have hit that losing run. They'll not know how to do that and it, their money just goes. 
It's as simple as that. The money just drops out of that account and all of a sudden they've hit that downturn and they're finished. And then they'll go on a winning run and they'll miss it. Simple as that. So we're going to have a portfolio strategy and we're going to keep building week on, week out. Now, this weekend, there's a lot of the EPL games coming up. It's a full weekend after the international break. And you look at four games this weekend that really the teams are underpriced. They're, they're, they're a shocking price. But if you bung them all together, you're getting 3.91 odds. And, and statistically, they should win. The, the Arsenal game, 1.56. The Man City game, 1.57. Man United game, 1.22. And a Chelsea game, 1.31. Add them all together, 3.91. Do them one at a time, you can maybe come out of the bet. Or keep your eye on Betfair, because that's the beauty of Betfair. If you've got a bet running, you can take your profit when you want. And it makes you a strong punter as well. But in the VIP services, we've got a few methods that we do with that. But that's something you can look at. And uh, that would be four teams to follow as your bankers. And you can bung another couple in there with two outcomes maybe in the, the games that can make your account grow. But that would be your four teams for this weekend. We've also got the St Ledger on. Now, the St Ledger favourite, 4.46, uh, I think it is, 1.66. That's odds are not interesting for me. They're a bit short. Probably should just be odds against, to be honest with you. But the second favourite at that price at, at the moment, uh, good, good lay bet. Um, I don't like laying above a certain price and it's just too high for me to lay it but it's a definite lay at the present moment of the, in the market and as I say the favourite's just a wee bit too short and if you've gone in at that price you're taking a bit of a risk to be honest with you you're not really getting uh, of any value to that so if it drifts the odds against you'd probably want to play but uh, doing it the odds on no thanks no for me uh, a great weekend coming up and as I say the portfolio's going to get stronger and stronger like the video, subscribe to the channel. We're going to add more content week in, week out. Always remember, it's your money, it's my money, it's everybody's money. So have respect for Betfair and have respect for the losers as well as the winners. I'll speak to you in the next video.